Hello, I'm Damian Mitchell. The opposition wants the government to extend the travel ban to all countries where the new strain of the coronavirus has been detected to protect Jamaicans from any possible risks. A two-week travel ban is now in effect to and from the United Kingdom. Meanwhile, there was anger aboard a British Airways flight on Monday as passengers were told that they would be going into 48-hour mandatory state quarantine on landing in Kingston. No sentence! No sentence! The National Housing Trust says as of January 2021, applications for contribution refunds will only be accepted online. The NHD says the move is part of efforts to keep customers and staff safe amid the COVID pandemic. 26-year-old Marley Brown, a musician of Main Street Runaway Bay St. Anne, has been charged in relation to a gun attack. Brown has been charged with wounding with intent, illegal possession of a firearm and illegal possession of ammunition following the December 12 attack on a man in Nine Miles District, Alexandria. In sports, the Issa Grace Kennedy Boys and Girls Athletics Championships has been set for Monday, March 22 to Saturday, March 27. Issa has, however, released a contingency date of May 4 to 8 should there be another spike in COVID-19 cases around the time planned. In your currency trading today, it was costing $144 for one US dollar, the British pound sterling for $193.90, and the Canadian dollar for $113.32. In your weather forecast, Wednesday morning will be partly cloudy across sections of northern parishes. It will be mainly sunny elsewhere. The afternoon will be partly cloudy. And that's it for the Gleaner Minute. I'm Damian Mitchell.